Hello beautiful glam girls, glam fam, glam everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy to be back on YouTube. And if you wow, well, my lips look really pale. It's okay, they'll they'll die down as I talk. But anyway, um so happy to be back on YouTube. If you haven't watched my New Year's Eve makeup tutorial where I was talking about why I want to come back to YouTube and my frustration with social media and feeling like I wanted to give up. And I just feel this renewed energy and excitement to be back on YouTube. And I really just want to bring back like that old school fun content from back in the day, back in my day on, on YouTube, you know, hauls and just hanging out and just talking with you guys and building that community. So I thought this would be the perfect time to bring back an old school video what I got for Christmas haul I almost forgot what I was gonna say what I got for Christmas haul and I'm really excited and this is no way in to brag or anything this is just fun also it's not like I've got anything that's like millions of dollars or thousands of dollars like it's fine um but I'm very very excited to jump into it it was a really good year for my Christmas gifts um I did give my mom and my husband a list but they also kind of did their own thing too and I love that about my family you know I don't have a big family I only get gifts from my husband and my mom and they always do such a great job so I'm really grateful and I'm really excited to show you what I got let's get into it because I have everything like in a little pile so I don't use it before I do this video so I'm so excited to get through it and share with you guys I will leave links to everything that I can find down below let's jump in okay, so I'm not gonna go in any particular order or anything like that I'm just gonna start grabbing stuff so you guys know that working out has really become a big part of my life I lost 50 pounds and I want to lose another 50 pounds this year so I'm really really working hard on getting back into the groove of working out and all that kind of stuff so I did put workout clothes on my Christmas list and so um i did put a specific brand which is beyond yoga and my husband did end up finding a pair but he got a size too small he ended up getting me an xl and i need at least a 2x um i found this brand because when i went to an event for first aid beauty they were partnering with beyond yoga and they gave us all a workout set actually let me grab it for you to show you i wear this workout set so often so here are the pants these are a size two. oh these are two x i thought they were three x so these are the size uh two x i got the purple bottoms as well as the cute little purple top and i love this top it's an all-in-one with a built-in bra which i love because i hate having to wear a sports bra and something on top so it's like a little racer back tank top I, this is a size 2x as well it is the most buttery stretchy soft material the top still fits decently but the bottom started to get big on me once i lost weight so i wanted um a smaller size but then my husband got an XL and the size difference between these is really big. So I definitely need like a 1X I think because the 2X is too big now. But the XL, when I tried it on, I just didn't want to force it to fit. Look at the difference. It's a lot smaller. So I don't know if there's a 1X in between or if maybe I just have to try it on and see if it stretches more. I don't know. But i'm so grateful that he was able to at least get a pair i'm gonna see if i can exchange them for a bigger size anyway point is i love this brand i definitely want more of their um workout clothing because i love workout clothes i love having cute workout sets i only wear them for working out i don't wear them outside the house um i only wear them for working out and i love having so many workout clothing options every day i have something cute to wear for my workouts and for me personally it really comes in handy i need to feel cute in my workout clothes, I need to feel like I'm showing up my best self and it just makes me feel better. And I also love things that are tight on the body because it helps me when I'm moving. I don't like to feel flabby like when I'm moving a lot and I'm jumping up and down the floor. And like I like to feel supported. So I love good workout clothes. Anyway, speaking of workout clothes, my mom ended up getting me some workout clothes as well. She got me some um, Target leggings, I believe. Or are these are these from Target? my mom got me some workout clothes as well and these are i don't know where she got these from but the brand is ultra no the brand is under armor i don't know where these are from but maybe she got them at like marshall's or something these are size 2x under armor they look like they're gonna fit i really like they're stretchy but like really tough so I'm definitely going to love these and they're not too long so they're perfect for me because I'm short but do you see that stretch? I'm so excited. She also got me a matching top, a little white top which I love these like 
tank tops because I don't like to feel naked when I'm working out so I don't want to wear just like a skimpy little sports bra but I also don't like full heavy t-shirts I, I I get hot really quick and I don't like when I'm sweating and I have a lot of material on me so I love things like this that are like a tank top and sports bra in one so this is also from the same brand and this is a large really really cute I can't wait to do my workout January 1st with my new workout set she also got me matching socks from the same brand and I thought these were so cute they're pink there's a few different sets in these um, and these are arch support fitted heel socks from the same brand look how cute there's pink in there and then there's a light gray um, with no there's a light gray with pink a dark gray with pink and a dark gray with white and then a white and pink so I love 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 the color combos on these this is gonna be great for the spring when I start taking my walks again when it starts to warm up a little bit even in the winter like I like taking walks a lot when I'm like really trying to lose weight taking walks really helps me so this is gonna be the perfect incentive to wear a cute outfit start my workouts walk more all that good stuff so i'm actually really happy it's so funny like they say when you get older how you really do enjoy getting like clothes and socks for christmas i'm in that era right now like i love getting a good outfit for christmas <laughs> um my mom also got me a cute little cozy outfit so this one is really cute she says she got it from walmart i believe so it's these cute little pants from joy spun look how cute they are they're like these cozy teddy bear like you know that teddy material really really cozy pants with pockets which i love and then she got the matching little top it's like a little cropped hoodie sweater and i love these little sets they're so cute i will say they run a little on the small side she got me a 2x in the bottoms and they just fit but they're a little snug and then the top is a size the top is a size large and that fits perfectly which is a 12 to 14 so i think the top fits well but the bottom is a little snug on me it's a size 2x but i'm keeping it these are perfect to wear when you are like running errands in the winter because a good set like this especially when it's a light color it looks so chic like you could throw on a really nice fancy coat on top with some good accessories and boom you are so cozy you're like wearing pajamas but you still look put together chef's kiss she knows me so well so i'm definitely gonna save it for when it's really bitter cold because when january february comes babe and it's 10 degrees outside this is what i'm gonna be wishing i had even if i just wear did i get lipstick on it oh my god i just got lipstick on it girl i hate myself sometimes i'll clean it right now <laughs> but sometimes you just want to wear something cozy that's warm you don't want to think too much about it this is the vibe okay more clothes my husband ended up i did need some new bras so i put that on my list as well and he picked up some bras for me from asos because i love the brand ivory rose it's one of the most comfortable bra brands that i have found and i have like multiple ones of their bras and i needed some nude and black ones some really basic ones because i wear like a hot pink bra like all the time and i was like okay you need some like regular colors but i didn't even think of that like i sent him like just bras and the size and I was like oh I just need some bras and he was the one that got me the nude and the black because he thought I needed more neutral colors and he's so right because he's right it's so true I do so very thoughtful of him I love how basic and comfortable these are they're like t-shirt style um the size I am is a 36 double no triple d 36 double d yeah UK 36 double d so that is the size I got and it fits really, really perfectly. And I love black and nude. I tried them on already. They fit well. So comfortable. So cute. Also got me a pair of undies. They were supposed to be five pair of underwear, but ASOS lost the package. So then they had to replace the package, but they only sent one pair of underwear. Anyway, it's really cute. These, It's like a thong and it matches a pink bra that I have. Look how cute. So yeah, got me that. And I was like, that's more for you, isn't it? It's for both of us, okay? Okay, so more clothing. Well, I guess, I guess it kind of counts as clothes from my husband. He's so thoughtful. He got me these gorgeous pair of sneakers. These are New Balance 550 em, uh, em, Emil, uh, Emilion Dor. That's the name. It was an Emilion Dor pair of New Balances. We were in the city a few months ago. 
and we went into like one of those sneaker shops and um i saw these and i was like oh these are beautiful like these are gorgeous i love them and he made a mental note to get them for me and i don't know how he managed to find the pair for me because these are limit they were like limited edition so it was really hard to find like a good kind of almost new pair and these are freaking stunning they're like that weathered suede so it almost looks like teddy material look how pretty and this colorway delicious they're so comfortable they're gorgeous and he was able to get them with multiple colored laces so i got white laces tan laces and then like the butter yellow laces so cute I, I cannot wait to wear these i don't know how he managed to score these he's such a freaking sneakerhead and i love him their clothing item that my brother got me this is also very thoughtful of him you guys know i went to puerto rico with my family back in um earlier this month in december and we were in the mall and we stopped into forever 21 and i found this beautiful headband with these gorgeous crystals and i was like oh my god i love this headband i need this and my mom was like put it back you don't need that it's whatever and i was like you're right fine like i'll put it back but then on christmas my little brother was like oh i bought it for you when we were there at the mall and i was trying to keep you away from like the register and i'm like oh that's so sweet like my little brother is so thoughtful for that and i really appreciate that he spent his little money to get me this beautiful rhinestone headband this is so freaking cute okay the rest of my gifts are all gifts from my husband so let's get into the bulk of the gift the biggest gift gift for last i did put on my list body washes because get a lot of pr packages of like body products and i've recently um last year got one of these in the mail this is the same product my husband got me two because he was like i know how much you love them so he got me two of them this is the salt air pink beach skin softening serum body wash coconut oil skin mimicking coconut naturally fermented pink oil gently cle cleans and restores essential moisture to dry skin i love 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 first of all the packaging on this gorgeous i love that it's just like pink beautiful and the scent is pink beach and it smells incredible it's like coconutty vanilla but very soft i love it so much and i love that it's a pump so in the shower i don't have to like do a bunch of freaking things to clean my body like i love having a pump because i put it on the shelf and then while you're in the shower you just few pumps of this it's a gel so it's so convenient for shaving for everything it smells amazing i have noticed that when i stopped using this my skin felt drier it felt bumpier so this definitely works i love 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 i swear by this like i said i got it in pr i wasn't paid to talk about it but i love it so much that i put it on my christmas list so i'm so happy to have this also i like to put the snow fairy shower gel on my christmas list every year because it's one of those like limited edition products that i love and i only use it like in the winter so this is the lush snow fairy shower gel this is a pink candy bubblegum scent um shower gel it smells so freaking good it smells like bubblegum and cotton candy. It's delicious. They have Snow Fairy everything. They have like Snow Fairy bath, bath, bath bombs and all types of stuff. But I love the shower gel the most. Again, I love shower gel. Like I'm not a soap bar girl. I'm a shower gel girly. And I love, love, love this one. And it is a vegan self-preserving product. So yeah, this was made uh, October 23rd. And it has a year on it. So I can use it up until December 2024. And I definitely will. It smells so good. And again, it's pink. All my gifts are pink. So next we have some perfumes. I love perfumes. I am such a perfume girl. I did say that the rest of my gifts were from my husband. But one of these perfumes is from my mom. This is the Lancome Idol, I think it's called. I don't know. The name is like weirdly not on the bottle. Yeah, it's the Idol Lancome. But I do love this packaging. This is the small bottle. But I love, love, love it. Because look how tiny it is. And it's super skinny. Like a freaking thinner than your freaking cell phone so this is going to be really good to put in my purse i love this perfume it smells so freaking good oh my god i'll put the notes on the screen it's such a fresh yummy but still warm sensual scent and i have been using this like crazy because i got like a little sample of it and i've been keeping it in my purse and i use it all the time it's become one of my favorite perfumes so i was like i need a full bottle i definitely will probably buy a bigger bottle for myself because I love it so much. But if you haven't smelled it, go check it out. And if you're looking for something that you can like keep in your purse, can it get any easier than this little thing? Like, 
it's so cute so yeah got that from my mommy so from my husband he got me two of my favorite perfumes these are refill like these are rebuys that i love so much first is by the fireplace from replica i have like this much left in my current bottle this is my favorite fall and winter perfume it smells so good like marshmallows and roasted fireplace in a jazz club like mm, so warm delicious sexy it's so good you can man or woman could wear this honestly it is delicious it has that burning wood chestnut marshmallow scent i am obsessed with this perfume and i'm so happy to have a new one because now i can actually use the rest that i have and just spray it like crazy Anytime you go out at night during the fall or winter, this is it. This is the one. Okay, and then the other perfume he got me is Burberry Her. I love this perfume. I It smells like candy, but like in a sweet, fresh way. It's super girly, super feminine. This is like for the girl who loves bows like me. Like super girly, super feminine, super sweet. Very light, fresh, young. I love this. It's a great daytime perfume. This is a great like school perfume, work perfume. Um, casual date night definitely just for like an everyday fresh sweet smell I love this perfume obsessed try it if you haven't tried it before I also put some candles on my list I put the um, by Rado by Rado uh, burning rose perfume on my list and the vanilla coconut Santo vanilla Velu spot candle so he got two of the he got me okay I can't, I can't think. Speaking of fragrance, we have some candles here. So we have the Byredo Burning Rose Candle, as well as the Santal Vanilla Coconut Blend uh, Volup Spa Candle. This one is so delicious. It is like a really beautiful cologne version of a vanilla perfume candle. Like it smells like, like a delicious man. It's so delicious. Like I'm going to save it for Valentine's Day and look at the packaging. It is like a super, super, super pale nude kind of blush. If it shows up, I don't know, the camera is not showing up. There we go. It's like a super, super pale blush nude shade. Such a gorgeous packaging. So I'm definitely going to keep this packaging when the candle is over. The candle is amazing too. He was like, I got you the small one because I wanted to make sure you would like the scent. And then on Christmas when we smelled it, we were both like, this is amazing. We need more. So I'm definitely going to probably get a bigger one of this for myself or maybe put it on my Valentine's Day list, my birthday list, because you guys know my birthday is February 15th. So I might just put this on my birthday slash Valentine's Day list. But oh my God, guys, this candle and I love how sexy and chic it is. It's black. It smells incredible. I love that real fresh rose scent and it smells like that. But it has like that burning woodsy note to it. And that's my favorite combination. The sexy woodsy notes mixed with the fresh feminine vibe of a rose. Because I just feel like that's me. Like I'm a burning rose. Like, oh, hello. All the femini femininity and glamour and sensuality and sexiness of a rose with the tough like burning vibes of a burning wood. Like I love that smells so good so definitely gonna have to get a bigger one of that because that will i will burn that in one night but it was very thoughtful of him to even get me one more scented things because i'm just i'm in my scent era i mean i've always been a scent girly but i'm in my scent era right now we got the laura mercier neroli du sud serum body cream so uh, laura mercier sent me a pr package of three little lotions and this was one of the scents in there i am obsessed if you're latino let me know do you guys remember this body product this baby perfume like literally baby cologne when my brother was a baby my mom drenched him in this and it smells so good like even we wanted to wear it <laughs> and this body cream smells exactly like that baby cologne but like the grown-up version exactly like it oh my god and it just brings me such good memories of when my baby my brother was a baby Oh, and it smells so delicious, guys. And this body cream, it's a serum body cream. And I, I can't tell you how freaking good this is. Like, you want a really good lotion, body cream? Look how silky and shiny my skin looks now. Look at the difference. Do you see that shine? This body cream is no joke. It makes you so hydrated. It's incredible. My skin never felt more hydrated and silky 
as when I use this. This and the Fenty Body Bo Body Butter Drop Lotion, the, those two, they have the same kind of almost oil in them that leaves your skin feeling really silky and oily and serumy. And it's so good for winter. You have to try it. It's worth I'm, it's worth the money. I know. I know. But it's worth it. I'll leave a link down below. Use my link, okay? <laughs> Alright, I also put some lip glosses on my list. These are two of my favorites. The This one from Give Beauty is not the exact one that was on my list, but my husband couldn't remember the name or he couldn't find it or something like that, so he got the closest he could find. And it's the Give Beauty lip gloss in the shade Candy. The one that I use is Sweet Tooth. It's my favorite. But when I tried this one, I was like, oh, this is pretty too. It's very similar, like a pinky nude. And I love it on top of nude lipsticks. It's so pretty. I love these lip glosses and I love the color. So now I have a new favorite. And this is another one of my favorites. I use this lip gloss every single day. This is Wifey for Lifey from Too Faced. It's literally the shade of my natural lips. It has like that mauve pink color, which is the shade of my natural lips. My natural lips are very dark. And I love this gloss. It is the perfect neutrally mauve shade for when I'm not wearing makeup. I wear it at home. It plumps my lips. I like to wear it all the time. I wear lip gloss at home all the time and this is my favorite one and I also like throw it in my purse when we're just like running errands or when I'm not wearing makeup. I love it. So this is like my glam gloss and then this is like my everyday gloss. They're my favorites and again, both pink. <laughs> more pink my mom got me the barbie movie on blu-ray this is the 4k ultra with the digital code um so plus so excited this one has the barbie featurettes um and i'm very very excited look how pretty it's all pink ah, i'm so happy like i was actually so happy when i saw this i was like yay barbie <laughs> I'm so excited to, to have it in my actual possession because I don't know about you guys, but I am restarting physical media collection and Barbie is added. I'm so excited for this. Even though I can watch it on HBO Max, I'm going to watch the DVD or the Blu-ray, right? Or is this a DVD? Girl, who cares? I think it's a Blu-ray. Yeah. Ultra HD Blu-ray. <laughs> okay. I told you I would save the best, the best big gift for last. And the last thing that I got was a new phone. I could not believe my husband got me a new phone. So he got me the iPhone 15 Pro Max. He got this shade because they called it natural. And it's supposed to be like a nude kind of tan shade. But it's actually gray. Which I'm kind of mad about because I wanted the white one. Like I always get like the either the gold version or the white version. Like my 12 Pro Max is white. So I'm really kind of like, ah, I hate the gray. But I'm very grateful. So I'm using it. Don't, mm, mm, mm. The, camera, the camera won me over. Okay. I did not upgrade my phone for so long. Like I said, I still have my 12 Pro Max with this shattered screen. <laughs> but I... I'm so happy to have a new phone because I needed one for a while and I just didn't want to spend the money because it's been hard these days with money. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to keep using my broken phone because it still works. And so he packaged it. He wrapped it up really nicely. And, you know, it was just a box. So I'm, I thought it was like a makeup palette because, like, it feels like a makeup palette in your hand when you're, like, unwrapping it. So I'm, like, unwrapping it and I'm like, is this a makeup palette? Like, I'm so excited thinking it's a makeup palette. And he's like, yeah. So I start opening it and I see the phone and I'm like, no way. Like I literally started crying just cause like last year he got me an iPad. Now this year he got me an iPhone. Like he's just been doing such amazing things with gifts every year and just getting better and better. And like just being such a thoughtful, amazing husband. So I was just really, really grateful. So I'm so excited to have a new phone guys. Like I have been obsessed with my new phone. I'm using it for photos all the time. Just I'm obsessed, like using all the new features and playing with it and learning about it. And I'm I'm really happy. It takes amazing photos, guys. Like, look at this. Straight from the camera roll. Amazing quality photos. This was today. Obviously, you can tell. But like, the freaking camera, what a game changer. What a game changer. I'm obsessed. So it just makes content creating so much better. I don't have to worry anymore. I can do so much more like YouTube content and just video content on my phone now. 
and I was before, but like you could tell the difference from the 12 to the 15, you can tell the difference. If you went from a 13 or 14 to the 15, maybe not, but going from the 12 to the 15, it's a huge difference. So I'm so happy. Um, and I will deal with the, the color of the phone by getting different phone cases. For example, I got me a white phone case and she works. Okay, boom. No one will ever know. No one will ever freaking know. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I hope that you had a great Christmas season. Hope that you had a wonderful new year. Hope that you are enjoying 2024. Um, and I love you guys so much. Stay tuned for more content. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on TikTok. Follow me on Instagram. I'm on Facebook. All the places. And join my channel on Instagram, Gabriella's Glam Girls. I always post my new videos. I post links. I post um you know specific like content that is exclusive for you guys we have little chats and polls and it's just like our little chat area for just you guys so i really really love it over there and let me know what kind of videos you want to see 2024 is going to be a year for youtube okay i am putting all my energy into youtube again and i am so excited to just be back here making community with you guys being one-on-one -on -one with you guys really loving on you guys and just feeling the love back and getting that inspiration because you guys are my inspiration like you guys give me confidence and i really miss that interaction so i love you so much and even if you don't want to leave a wordy comment you're not a commenter leave me your favorite new year's emoji like what feels the most new year to you because i want to interact with you even if it's just to say thank you i love you guys so much stay glam besos bye